Hello? Is, can you focus on me? Thank you. Hello, beautiful. What's up? So, let me just tell you how hard my life is. Ooh, it's just so hard sometimes. I filmed a video a couple days ago and it, um, I got back the edits today that I was working on with my editor and <laughs> it looked terrible, so I trashed it. And now I'm back, ready to film again. We're gonna try and pump this one out. <laughs> So you guys have a video to watch this week because I don't wanna be a failure. So um, yeah, the video was awful. Uh, really, I should have never filmed that video. It was bad. Like I couldn't even watch it. I I mean, I usually can't really watch my own videos because they're just like, mm, it's just like a lot. But like that one was a whole other level of like, what the f what was I thinking? So. I'm here now, <laughs> ready to film again, and actually in a way better mood this time, which is weird considering it's 1 a.m. here, and I haven't, I mean, I woke up at like 9.30 this morning, and I have been nonstop working since 9.30, but oddly in a good mood. So, we're gonna, I don't, I'm not usually in a good mood a lot, so why don't we um do a reaction video while I'm in a good mood still, all right? And then I'm gonna go back in a bad mood and go to sleep. <laughs> I also could not find a good video to watch last time, and now I just found a great video to watch with you guys. I mean, do the stars align or do they like align? Because they definitely align in my eyes. So today, we're watching a girl. She's trying to go from black hair to silver hair by herself at home. And her hair is mad long. And the thumbnail looks juicy. And you know I couldn't finish this intro without telling you guys thank you so much for purchasing Glitterati. And thank you just for supporting Glitterati. Like, mm, if you guys didn't already know, this is my first hair care product to be released under my own brand, Ex Mondo. It's called Glitterati. If you guys want to check it out, if you don't want to, if you want to my life for no reason in beauty columns. I don't know. What am I talking about? The link's below if you want it. It's a really cool product. Look up reviews if you want to. People really like it. So... Yeah, thank you so much for supporting Glitterati. And, and, and shop at xmodohair.com. Follow us on Instagram, xmodohair. Follow me on Instagram. All right, so if you guys are ready to watch somebody mess up their hair and see what I think about it, then let's watch the damn video. Let's do it. Oh, ow. <laughs> that was uncomfortable. Today's video is called Dyeing My Hair Gray Full Video by Lauren Elise. Elise, this is a gem. I'm just waiting to be unwrapped. I can feel it. I can feel a good video coming today. I can feel it. I decided to just make my own video about, sorry, that's our washer. Um, that's okay. About just me dyeing my hair gray. Oh, wow. Oh, oh wow. So her hair is up. So really pretty. We had the color that I was going to dye my hair in a powder. Wait, why, uh, um, I already have a lot of questions and we haven't even really gotten into it yet. So, why are we ruining your beautiful hair too? Why are we not going to a damn hairstylist? I don't know, I think it's fun for people. I have a theory that people have fun ruining their hair. And I don't know what it is, because I mean, I, don't, I kind of understand it. Like when I was younger, I definitely didn't really care. And also like nowadays, I really still don't care that much. Okay, so like, what am I talking about? Um, but like there's something fun about ruining your hair and having to fix it. Is that true? But her hair's really pretty and really long. I really hope she has hair in her damn head when she's done. That's my only hope. Very low standards today. So I get this to remove the color. This stuff and mix it up um, this with the same amount of developer. She said you're gonna want to use this instead of the powder. So whenever she said that, I immediately thought the colored powder. What? But I'm gonna mix one part. Hold on. This. I am Makes very it. confused. I mean, be better, this so. might be the most confused I've ever been. Mix. Permanent cream liner. Okay. Two plus 18 equals, move the 10 over, add seven, divided by four, add five more, divided by two again. Okay, so this doesn't make sense to me. Um, We went from color remover packets to now she's using cream liner. Honestly though, I love cream liner. Cream liner is the <laughs> Powder liner can literally go bye bye and I wouldn't care. Like people are literally sleeping on cream lightener. Why? I'm guessing that she already has color in her hair right now, brown hair color and she's trying to remove it. But also 
I don't know. I think she just got confused and then confused me in the process. So she's also using 40 volume with it. Wouldn't recommend it. I'm pretty sure her, her hair is not colored. She definitely just got confused with the color remover because she has no color in her hair. She doesn't need to remove any color because there's no damn color in her hair. <coughs> oh, let's keep watching. She's gonna need a okay, lot so I have my, like, of that. Lightener mixing with my 40 volume. I don't know whether to hit the roots first. No, if you've or... learned anything. <laughs> Usually no. I don't know why you're doing this either, honey. I'm scared. <laughs> Me and everybody else watching is too, so. Oh my god, yes, technique. <laughs> Get the lightener on. Check in with y'all whenever it's All right, y'all. Hi, guys. So, I'm on three, my third um, layer, and this is already blonde. So, Wait, whoa. Um, it's working a little bit better than I anticipated. Okay, so, so yeah, she definitely has does not have color in her hair. This is her natural hair color, and it is lighting quickly. And also, maybe she's just working really slow. I don't know what you want to go with, but it's a big decision, and I'm not going to make it for you. You know? Girl! Oh! Two big sections! Uh, like rush, but I don't need rush. It's too big! You're going to miss so many spots. See, that's the issue with lightener. It doesn't, like, it doesn't work like shampoo. Believe it or not, lightener is not shampoo, so it doesn't, like, lather. It's not going to, like, go onto a hair strand and then, like, seep through to the other side. So, like, <laughs> the whole take a big section, put a lot on, and go. I can definitely say it does not work. Nope. Every time I've been in a rush and I do a bigger foil than I should do, there's always that one little piece that wasn't colored. And guess whose fault that was? Literally mine. Um, stop being lazy, Brad. Stop being lazy, Lauren. Put in the work or else your hair is gonna look like <laughs> which it probably already does. It's freaking blonde. Just saying. Go ahead. So I'm just gonna twist it and clip it up. It's four or seven, so I'm She's gonna living her best five. life though, you can tell. Living right her now? best country life. Ooh. It has literally Ooh. been like 10 minutes. Ooh. Ooh. This is insane. I don't even know what it's gonna look like after an hour. For real so. though, <laughs> that is so lightning right now, really fast. Up, it just... And she doesn't even have a bag over her head, keeping the heat in. Like there's nothing, and that shit is just like, and I'm excited yeah, about it. it. Stop itching it. You're gonna make it worse. I'm genuinely scared that in some parts up here, it's not gonna be bleached. It says wait 24 hours before bleaching again, but technically that's if you're bleaching the same hair and it's different hair, but- What? Hold up. <laughs> Lauren, where's the other head coming from? I thought you only had one head, Lauren. Something's not adding up. Is it definitely the same hair, Lauren? Unless you got multiple heads, I don't know. I literally wouldn't judge, but something doesn't add up. To me. The only time I've ever put bleach on my hair is whenever I did my own ombre, and it was like an ombre kit, and it worked. It was cute, but this is really it's gonna screw ombre. My hair. I'm sorry. Jackson I'm coming just for got you. back, and this is what we are gonna uh, be doing. Uh, quick blue. This is what I'm using. Of course. L'Oreal High Performance. Of course, we're going for the battery it's acid. Fine. Yeah, Princess is like kind of my nerve this. Oh, what's it look like, bro? <gasps> You're orange and yellow. You got. <laughs> Wait. Definitely is. Yeah, you got a lot of it's not too bad. I'm like, my, like, that's insane. Like, can you imagine if I let it go to that? Uh, and focusing in on literally it? Literally the goal. Wait, I think there's stuff in that. Literally the goal. Insane. So, my hair is dry now. You know, oh. See, there's like a streak of stuff. Oh, right no. Uh, I'm not too worried about it. I'm not gonna, like, add more bleach. She makes one of us. I just opened the package to the L'Oreal <laughs> Blue. Come like this. Oh no! <laughs> Wait, what? Mix. One scoop. Mm. And not the quick blue. Mm. Two scoops. I'm scared. Yo, she missed scoops. so many spots on that head. So oh no, is this 40 volume ounces. again? One fluid ounce is a fourth cup, so we're gonna be doing. Don't, don't do the 40. About don't do the 40. Two fluid ounces. Don't do right there. So now I'm adding this color sealer. Step two, the absolute perfection color sealer in here. Hold on. Restore moisture and smooth as well, protecting and strengthening natural hair bonds. Okay, you're definitely not supposed to put conditioner in bleach. <laughs> Whoever told you to do that was very incorrect. No, you can put it probably in color. Um, color bleach is not color. You can't put a conditioning product inside bleach. It's just gonna dilute the bleach, probably. I'm gonna say it right now, and that ain't it, Lauren. Sorry, yeah. Lauren, I'm really coming for you today. I don't know, Amazing. It's I'm not trying to, it's just happening. It's really easy. Um, and now we're putting more that. stuff in the bleach. Okay, I'm, get all the plaques. Now I'm gonna apply this. Back to the roots first. 
<laughs> no! Stop doing the roots first! And for the billionth time, if you guys want to know why you shouldn't do the roots first, it's because you have heat from your scalp that processes the hair quicker at the root than it does at the end because you do not have heat on your ends naturally. For the billionth time. What a supportive boyfriend. Make sure and this video should be dedicated to this boyfriend. Years. All he wants is a blonde girlfriend and it's just guys, not gonna happen. The toner question mark is in. And I'm gonna let this sit for 50 minutes which I was is saying. Is it? Happen. Cause that looks like bleach still. <laughs> I'm scared my hair's gonna fall out. Most likely it is. So. My scalp like burns. <laughs> my hair now. It's usually what happens when you color and it 25 and times in a day. Yo, how is that? That's not toner, that's hour. bleach. What? Because I use such a strong first bleach that raised it so much. Wait, what? Oh my god, I literally, this is hurting my head. I can't follow along. She said she was using toner and but it was most definitely bleach. But does she think that bleach is toner? I don't know. Wow, it looks kind of good. Is nothing. It's so yellow, y'all. I don't know why it's coming up so blonde on camera. I'm gonna turn oh, the Just kidding. Oh, it's there we go. mad yellow. The last step is to dye it. Okay, so her. now she's toning it. And I will see y'all in a bit. Jackson just went up to- Oh my god, yo! Just went up to Kroger. So this is fun though. Like she looks way cooler than she did with brown so hair. I approve. Or conditioning treatment. Oh, I hope this days, like somewhat works yeah. out for her. Oh, I it's a little. Mm, mm, yeah. It looks great for one time. Hey guys, so I'm putting this on my oh, hair. Oh, here we go. Like dark. Oh no, um, Lauren. Oh, this no. is the last step. Lauren, save yourself. Yo, it's mad dark. What is this color she's putting on? It's like black. I don't know. How's it back? Oh, this is looking like a really bad idea. Now it's time to see. I'm scared. It worked. Did it? That ain't it. That ain't it. That ain't it, Lauren. You look so good blonde. Okay, you ready? I'm ready. I like it. I think it looks so good. Love Jackson. <laughs> Jackson, crazy? you're the star. Yeah, it's crazy. In the front, there's still blonde spots, but like, Ooh. oh my gosh, like, it actually works. Heck yeah. I love that. It worked. Thank y'all so much for watching that. I know it was kind of like choppy, and I will include all the products that I use in the description box below. Please, my Wait. <sighs> Um, Why is her hair back to dark? Because I ended up dyeing my hair back to this color on New Year's Day, literally not even 12 hours later. And I could feel how damaged it was. And I just got this like $20, $25 deep conditioner. It looks so dope in the Polaroids that we took. That's about it. Thank y'all for watching and subscribe. And like. <laughs> Lauren, what? That was a roller coaster, man. Like, I just went to Disney a couple weeks ago, and that was crazier than any of the roller coasters I went on. That was the ride of the year we just went on, and I still don't understand what happened at the end. This is the mystery of a lifetime. So you spent an entire day bleaching your beautiful, healthy hair to gray. You got it to a gray that you liked, personally, wasn't my favorite. <laughs> Honestly, you look really good blonde though. I think you should have like toned the blonde like nicely, like made it like a nice ash blonde. Not gray, but like ash blonde will look great. Surprise. And then you colored your hair brown 12 hours later. You know what? At least you're having fun with your hair. <laughs> good for you. <laughs> All right. Don't forget to live your extra life. And I will see you. Oh, next time. Peace.